This video is sponsored by Trailer Training UK. Welcome to my channel, my name is Luke, thank you very much for watching. Today is Friday, today is Truck Fest. What day is it? Truck Fest. That's my daughter. You won't be able to see her, I don't think, from the, from where you are, but you can hear her. Are you looking forward to going to Truck Fest? Yeah. Yeah? Last time, last year, you were four. You were five this year, obviously, a year later, obviously. But you fell asleep last year. Are you going to fall asleep on the way there this year? No. No? I reckon you will. I reckon you will. Anyway, so um, we're actually leaving quite late, so Jabba, if you're watching this, thank you very much for making us leave quite late. Half past three is the latest I want to leave, he says. The latest. We left pretty much quarter four. <laughs> so, never mind. The ETA there is between five o'clock and half past five. Uh, there's a shed load of traffic between us and there, and obviously rush hour traffic come five o'clock as well on a Friday, so it is going to be quite late time we get there. I reckon we could be there before six, but um, it, it is looking like it's going to be relatively late before we get there. And then of course we've got to set up the tent, we've got to set up the gazebo, that's going to take an hour, so it's seven o'clock in the evening. I mean, we wouldn't have even started cleaning by then, we've got to clean the trucks, polish them, all sorts. So I can't see us <laughs> even contemplating finishing until at least nine o'clock tonight. But it's not a big deal because it's going to be light out. But um, the girls have got a swimming pool, so you'll, you'll be happy, won't you? Yeah. You've got a swimming pool, so you'll be all right. Are you looking forward to a swimming pool? Yeah. Yeah? Is it big enough for Daddy? No. No. I might be able to get my leg in and that's about it. It's a small one, isn't it? No. <laughs> so yeah, so um, we're going to crack on. We're on the A417 right now. We've got to go down Birdlip Hill, there's a lot of traffic. We've got to go onto the M5, past Tewkesbury, onto the M50, and then also take the B Road up to Melbourne. We're going to hit a lot of traffic. We're only an hour and 10 minutes away, so it's not going to take too long to get there. It's just a bit of traffic between us and there. <coughs> With regards to my illness, I feel better, but I don't feel 100%. But never mind. We'll have to wait and see whether I get any better tomorrow. I haven't had a chance to wash the truck. Um, I gave it well, I gave it a quick blast, I'm not gonna lie, I gave it a quick blast, but that's about it. I haven't had time to scrub it. So when we go in, we are gonna have to pay 25 quid to have it washed. And I say we are gonna have to pay because we both need to get the trucks washed, so it's 25 quid each. And um, luckily my boss has given us the money for the, for us to do that. By the way, if you don't know, that is my boss's truck right in front of us. Uh, but it's not my boss driving, it's Jabba. Jabba is a childhood friend of mine. Hang on, childhood friend? No, he's a family friend, not a childhood friend. He's a family friend who's known me since I was a child. I was like 10 years old, he's my dad's mate. So my dad's mate Jabba's driving that with his brother, Robert. I'm in my truck with my eldest daughter, Lexi. Say hello. 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 And then my girlfriend is behind me with my younger daughter, Lottie. So yeah, we've got a little convoy going, nothing major, just a free, three vehicles, two trucks, one car. And we need to get the trucks washed before we actually go into the showground. So yeah, anyway, let's crack on and uh, I'll see you guys when actually we're about to enter Melbourne. So we left the yard at about half past three, quarter to four, something like that. And it should only take an hour, 10 minutes tops to uh, to actually get here, which means basically we should have been here by about quarter to five. Uh, it's currently quarter past five. <laughs> so we're a half an hour behind, if you like. And we've still got another 15 minutes to go before we're actually there. So. It's, it's, it's taken us 45 minutes longer than what it should have done, and that's purely because of traffic. The, the, the amount of traffic going down Birdlip Hill uh, was immense, and there was some sort of idiotic um, home bargain driver who kept stopping. He was in an Arctic, he kept stopping and letting in other vehicles to get in front of him. 
And as I went past, I had a look and he was on his phone, on the steering wheel, so just not paying attention to the road ahead of him. But never mind, we're nearly here. Seven more miles, 14 more minutes from now. You're still awake, aren't you, Lexi? Yeah. Yeah, you're still awake. I bet I did. You're never going to go to sleep again? No. Anyway, you'll go to sleep later on, you'll be tired. Gee. Yeah. But you th you're, you're saying that you're bored now, aren't you? Yeah. You want to get out, stretch, stretch your legs? Have a play. Have a play, yeah. You're going to be setting up the tent, yeah? No. <laughs> right, anyway, let's crack on. We, uh, we're nearly here now, so enjoy the next little bit of time-lapse footage of us getting into the event, and I'll see you when we're packed up. Right, so we've just got to go over these uh, traffic lights and it should be up on the right. Blue and brown gates, red and yellow gates. Which gate do we need? Brown, blue, yellow or green? I don't know. You don't know? What do you mean you don't know? I don't know which gate. We're going to get lost. Let's follow Jabba. Follow Jabba, okay. Come on Jabba, let's, let's go in the right gate. I'm pretty sure last time we went straight on and we sort of turned right. Oh, truck entry, straight on. Straight on to truck entries. That's where we're going. Look, it's trucks. That's Truck Fest there, look on the right. Truck Fest. Truck Fest, we're here. There's lots and lots of trucks. There are. I thought, uh, I thought we were going to the speed No, we're not going to be the only ones that be here. Blue gates, brown gates. Anyway, so we're here now. So um, I'm going to leave the dash cam recording um, so we get ourselves lined up. We've got to get the truck washed as well. So uh, yeah, we'll see you when we're actually parked up properly. the hang of this look, someone's uh, cleaning the truck for me, you can't quite see, there's my daughter, in the mirror, just paid 20 quid to get the truck cleaned. We got it down to a T, haven't we? Yes. It's hands on training. <laughs> right, so time now is five past ten nearly. Currently four minutes past ten. And we're uh, pretty much finished sorting everything out. Got a few more things that need doing personally in the morning. I've got to clean my windscreen. Couple of smudges on the windscreen, but uh, 
get the window cleaner out and I start doing it tomorrow morning. It's the boss's truck. Yeah, it's getting on. We never never really realised it was that late until about 15 minutes ago. They said it was quarter to ten. But uh never mind. There isn't actually no one parked next to me yet. But maybe more people will come here in the morning. Who knows? But it's quite a good view at the moment. The sun sets over there, which is really nice. I haven't yet walked round our tents there. But yeah, I haven't yet walked round to see what other vehicles there are here, but we will do in a bit, I'm sure. this uh, GoPro is actually recording sound very well I might be quite quiet so um, bear with me but yeah we are um, here on a Saturday and uh, like I said I've seen loads, loads of you today which is really good we're gonna go and have a look at some trucks now because I haven't had a chance to actually do it during the day because I've been seeing so many of you guys so uh, I'm just gonna check out some trucks
Hello. Hello. Oh, it's Luke. Look. And that's Scott. What's <laughs> <laughs> oh, it going, Luke? You right? Yeah, not yeah, bad, yeah, mate. Not bad. Truck fest going alright, Dick. It's going yeah. good. Yeah. We're, um, we're actually just outside my truck, aren't we? We've got that. Yeah, We're both both vlogging at the same time. <laughs> Vlogception. <laughs> no, it's cool. I've, first time I've actually ever seen Scott as well. Yeah. So, apart, from, yeah. apart from yesterday. But apart from yeah, yeah. The thing. It's been alright. It's been alright. Yeah. You still haven't seen my truck yet. Uh, I'll have to come over tomorrow. I think. <laughs> for that. Yeah, like literally up there. In the corner. Right in the corner as you come in. I'm like. At the back of the show, and you're more towards the front, aren't you? You're like somewhat central, I'd say. Love my flag as well. Show him my flag. <laughs> he doesn't think highly of himself, does he? It's my flag. <laughs> I love that flag. <laughs> yeah, cool. so follow this guy, but you probably already do so, yeah. <laughs> and if you don't follow Scotland, go follow him. Link is in the description below as well. Uh, what he said. <laughs> That's cool. Right, anyway. Right, this is. Uh, take two on a bit of recording um, inside the cab because this is the first time pretty much I've actually recorded on my camera um, on my I got a Galaxy Note is it Galaxy Note? Galaxy S Edge 9 something I can't remember it's been such a long day and I'm really tired it's quarter to 11 at night at the moment and um, we've been up since half seven it's been non-stop all day I've seen so many people today um, I've, I've literally lost count on probably but up to a hundred people I've seen today um, and I've gone and sat in my truck and taken photographs and I've given stickers too so it's really great to actually see everybody and see so many people and it's only Saturday we've got to do it all again tomorrow and I'm absolutely knackered but it's good it's really nice to see everybody and I'm really actually looking forward to seeing everybody, everybody tomorrow as well I can't get my words out I'm so tired um, I want to apologise for that little bit of footage you just seen with me and Scott Andrews. It was so cheesy. He um he said, "Should we do some vlogging? Should we do some vlogging together?" I was like, "Yeah, go on then. I don't mind. Let's, let's do a little bit of vlogging." Um, I don't know. It was like spur of the moment. It was like I vlog at the same time, so we get the same footage. And I was like, "What do we say?" And he goes, "Oh, let's just make it up on the spot." <laughs> That's pretty much what we did. Literally making it up off, up on the spot, and it was just quite awkward and quite cheesy. Off camera, we talk fine, like completely natural, like we're best mates. But um, on camera, it's just it was quite awkward. But never mind. Honestly, though, if you have if you haven't actually subscribed to Scott, go subscribe to him, ch his channel. The link is in the description below. Oh, bit blurry. Uh, this is the second attempt of recording this bit on this phone because I had image stabilization on, and because of these beacons that are flashing, the picture basically was like all jittery. It was like blah, 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 blah. so. Um, I've turned off image stabilization. I thought I could just quickly record this segment again. Um, yeah, I'm going to go to bed in a second, or at least try to go to bed, because, like I said, it's quarter to 11, a lot of people are actually still awake, um, it's not, not even quarter to 11 now, it's 5 to 11, it was quarter to 11 when I started filming, so it's basically nearly 11 o'clock by the time I finish this, people are still awake, um, and they're, they're right to, it's Saturday night, do you know what I mean, people are going to stay awake quite late, having parties, having discos, disco lights from the trucks, music's playing, horns are being honked, it's all right if you're in the cab because the cab takes most of that noise out. But I'm actually sleeping in the tent with my girlfriend and kids, so there's not a lot we can do about that. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to sleep in here. Um, Jabba, who's brought down my boss's truck, which is obviously parked next to me, is sleeping in that truck. But his brother is sleeping in my truck, as I think I've already mentioned. So if I do sleep in here, then I'm going to have to kick him out. <laughs> um, so yeah, I don't know what else to say really. We. Um, Spent most of the day meeting people. I did go to the arena and had a look at some of the monster truck action that was going on over there. I'm actually hoping to try and get a bit more footage of that tomorrow to include on this video. Um, see some monster trucks, see some stuff that they do, you know, monster truck rides and the bikes that are jumping up and down and things like that. Um, one of the first times I actually went around and had a look at the trucks was basically tonight. Um, I didn't do any filming during most of the day today really until about six seven o'clock at night so we went around and I tried to get as much as I could and you would have seen that footage as on this video right now and I can't get my words out I'm so tired I can't get my words out so I do apologize I'm gonna have to go get some sleep um, what else I've done I've done 18,000 steps if I said that yet I've done 18,000 steps today and I've drunk a hell of a lot of fluids 
and probably 10 litres plus of fluids today. And plenty of ice creams as well. I've got to have some ice creams to try and keep cool. But yeah, no, it's been one of those days. It was one of those days where at 9 o'clock this evening it was still 26 degrees out. It was, it's was. it been mad hot all day and actually all weekend. And actually, I don't know if you can see right now, but I'm a little bit sunburnt on my nose. No, I'm not really sunburnt. It doesn't hurt. It's just a little bit red. <laughs> um, Java just see me recording on the camera. You want to go to bed? That's my girlfriend saying she wants to go to bed. Hang on. Pardon? I'm going to bed. You're going to bed. You're going from glasses on the kids' seats still. You're now on the vlog. Uh, I don't know actually. Can you see? You? No. Where are you? It's very dark. Oh, well, I'm coming. Don't worry. I'm saying bye and I'm going. Okay. Let me say bye then to my followers. It's okay, take your time. I can read my book. You take your time. All right, I'll take my time. Bye. Um, what was I saying? I don't even know what I was saying. Yeah, like I said, we're, <laughs> we're all tired. Girlfriend's going to bed, so I need to come go to bed as well before I get in the bad books. Um, yeah, I'm going to go. I'll do some more recording tomorrow, and uh, yeah, I'll see you then. Bye. <laughs> Craig, you're now in the vlog. Hi. I ain't done yet, yes. Just because you said that? There you go. Okay, the tyres are five foot six tall, they're four foot wide, and it doesn't stay on the big wheels all the time. So when we come to the look, look, it's bigger than Mikey's. Ready? Should we do it? Let's do it. Get that engine switched on, Tony. It's time to get going. Right, so we're just, just leaving Truckfest now. It's uh, 25 past two. There's someone who recognizes me. See you later. And uh, yeah, so it's been a really good weekend. This time last year, I've become employed by, uh, by JK Transport. So I've now officially been working for JK for a year. And in that 12 months, I've driven six trucks. 
So, on average, two months a truck. And we're just getting lots of people now taking photographs of us as we go out. Oh, and then when we go back to the yard tonight, I've got to basically. I don't know if you can quite see. Let me just get. Let me get up to him a sec. On the back of his fifth wheel, like, you see there's like a, a white cover with, with a wrap on it. That's on the back of both of these trucks, and I need to take them off, put them away. Um, and then I need to get all my stuff out that I need out of this truck. In fact, everything, because I'm off for a week. Um, I need to put what I need in that truck, because I'm driving that truck tomorrow and Tuesday. So like sat nav and everything like that. And then uh, I need to hitch that truck up to my trailer. And I need to put this truck in a suitable place, ready for its MOT. <coughs> here we go, some photographs are being taken here, look. Guy in the white. Or not. Just waving, saying hello, saying bye to everyone. Oh, don't say bye to me then, that's fine. <laughs> Said bye to him. Um, I'm going to try and race him home. We go the same speed, but I've got 40 horsepower more than him, so I'm hoping I can like get in front of him off a roundabout. Use my power. Got to give way to the left here. Also, the last time we come out of here, there were like people waiting for us and not asking us to beat the horn and stuff. I've got a gay horn on here. It needs to be a bit more meaty. Many, many people have said I need to get a new horn. Absolutely right. I've got a friend behind me as well, just making sure she's getting out. Right, so we're now, now officially outside truck first. Turn on the air conditioning, it's well hot today. 28 degrees. 28 degrees. What's that noise? I think that's my brush on the back of the cab. It's knocking against the cab. I need to sort that out. Ah, oh dear. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. It's been a good weekend, man. Very hot. I need to get out while these lights are still green. Yeah, it's been, been very, very hot weather. Bought myself some new specs. Those of you who knows me, you, you know the fact that I like having different specs. I've <laughs> got four pairs of sunglasses in this cab. This pair. That pair. That pair. And that pair. I've got silver, orange, blue and green. <laughs> I like my sunglasses. I don't know why. Some people have fascination with watches. Some people have fascinations with cars and trucks. I've got kind of a fascination with sunglasses, so that's good. Got the sunroof open and a bit of air in. So yeah, ETA back to the yard is quarter four, an hour and ten minutes away. I'm gonna just keep the aircon on, listen to some tunes and just try to relax. I'm most comfortable while I'm driving. So, luckily we're now driving. Got my taco card in as well to drive back with. We took our taco out Friday evening, about, I can't remember now, about six o'clock, something like that. And it's now two o'clock on Sunday, so I believe that counts as a reduced rest. So I'm taking a photograph. Um, so what that means is I need to have a long rest the next weekend, but it doesn't matter because I'm not actually working after Tuesday. Tuesday's my last day and I'm not for a week because I've already said so. It doesn't matter if I can have a reduced rest. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. That was my 2018 Malvern Truck Fest experience. Taking my white truck. I'm trying to think of a name for this truck because at the moment it's just pure white, isn't it? I might have to call it like, what should I call it? the white something <laughs> leave a comment down below if you can think of something cool to call it anyway thanks for watching i'll uh, i'll see you in the next video till next time drive safe bye bye